Now let's try to convert this English statement into uh, a shortcut using the variables. The automated reply cannot be sent when the file system is full. So try to identify what are the statements in this and then what are the connectives. Depending on that, we can form the variables, you know, statement with the variables, compound statement. So if you observe this, the automated reply cannot be sent. This is one statement. When is the connective? The file system is full. This is the second statement, right? Now, if this is given and if they have already given like this, let P denote the automated reply can be sent. And Q denote the file system is full, right? And if you observe this, it is in the form of P when Q, isn't it? I think negation P because if P denote the automatic reply can be sent, then the automatic reply cannot be sent has to be represented using negation P. Therefore, it is negation P when Q. Got it? So, if you observe this, if I have this statement like this, if I have hypothesis implies conclusion, then if I have to write it using when, you can use, you can watch that uh, video where I have shown the various representations. It is conclusion when hypothesis. It makes sense. You can check that. Now, in this case, so what does it mean? After when, whatever is present is going to be hypothesis. Therefore, after when, where whatever is present, this Q is going to be hypothesis, right? Therefore, Q implies and before when, whatever is present, that is conclusion. Therefore, before when, what is present? Negation P. So, negation P is going to be conclusion. Got it? So, simple. Identify the statements, identify the connectives and then you can form the compound statement. So, using this, we can represent the compound statement, this entire statement like this. Okay? And you know, this one, if you look at the statement, these such statements will be formed when we are trying to uh, specify the characteristics of a system that we are trying to build. build. Maybe this entire system denotes that we are trying to build a uh, email server and what are the specifications that the users have. Now as an engineer, you are just collecting the requirements and specifications and you are writing them all down for the developers to look at. Now by writing all these requirements, developers will know that, oh, this is the case. And by writing like this in logic, there will be no ambiguity. Got it? Okay. Hi. If you are planning to do masters, then doing masters abroad is better than doing masters in India. I will give you all the reasons. So, first reason is, out of 1 lakh students who take GATE every year, there are only 500 seats in old IITs. So, all the IITs put together have an acceptance rate of 0.5%. And IITs, universities better than IITs, they have very good acceptance rate like 30%, 40%. But all the IITs put together have an acceptance rate of 0.5%. And if you are working hard to get into IIT Bombay, IIT Bombay's ranking is 177 and IIT Roorkee's ranking is 400. If you are happy to get into IIT Roorkee, then getting into universities better than IIT Roorkee is easier compared to getting into IIT Roorkee. And looking at the salaries for computer science, for software jobs, if you have done your master's in computer science in US, the salaries are ranging from 80 lakhs per year to 1.2 crore per year. So even if you take an average of 1 crore per year, your savings will be much higher than the salaries in India. After taxes and your cost of living, you can easily save 40 to 50 lakhs uh, per year. And in India, the maximum jobs that you get is around 30 lakhs. So your savings will be much greater than the salaries in India and these are all the services that we provide university shortlisting so depending on your profile we will shortlist what are the universities that you have to apply and statement of purpose building and then LOR guidance 
and GRE and English test assistance and education loan assistance. So you don't have to have any collateral, which, which means without any security, now you can get education loan. Getting education loan is very simple these days. And whatever the amount fee, the amount of uh, fee that you have, you have a range of uh, universities. You can apply for 10 lakh universities, 20 lakh universities or 50 lakh universities. But whatever it is, you are going to get complete education loan and you can pay off your education loan in one year after you, getting it, after you get a job. And then we do visa assistance, mock visa interviews and then connecting with the university alumni. So now you might ask why we should join Game of Visas. So the answer is we have 90% success rate, 99% success rate. And these are all the destinations that we guide the students to. So we guide students to any country that you want to go. So now it is not just USA. We guide to UK, Germany, Australia, Canada. So we guide, we guide students to all the countries. We work with all the destinations. And if you are interested in going abroad, you have to just drop us a message on this WhatsApp number 9494 Okay, thank you.